remembrance of courage past. Oh my god. This episode from Courage the Cowardly Dog sucks. Here are the reasons why I hate this episode in my opinion. This episode begins as Courage prepares to enjoy empanadas with milk, he notices a missing dog ad on the back of a milk carton, triggering a series of flashbacks about his abandonment as a puppy. His loving parents took him to the vet after a mishap, and in a cruel turn of events, the veterinarian kidnapped them, leaving Courage traumatized. Courage, lost in his memories, neglects his empanadas. Eustace seizes the opportunity to claim the meal for himself, expressing disdain for courage. Muriel, concerned about courage's behavior, decides to take him to the vet. In another flashback, a young courage follows the veterinarian to a secret lab, where dogs are caged, and then to the launch pad, witnessing the evil vet's malevolent plans. In the present day, Muriel and Eustace unknowingly take courage to the same veterinarian who turns out to be the evil vet from Courage's past. Recognizing Courage, the vet expresses a sinister desire to speak with the dog alone. Courage, aware of the impending danger, escapes the checkup room, leading to, a pursuit through the hospital. Flashbacks reveal Courage's failed attempt to rescue his parents from the evil vet's rocket launch, where the vet shoved Courage's parents into the rocket and shutting the rocket store activating the countdown, and therefore preparing the rocket for launch. As the vet spots courage trying to rescue his parents, he gasps in horror of the sight of the evil vet. In, the present day, courage is ensnared in the vet's net as he activates the rocket's launch sequence, throwing courage into the rocket and latching the door shut. Eustace and Muriel arrive just in time to witness the villain's evil plan and are also captured. In a heart-wrenching flashback, Courage's parents remain trapped inside the rocket, their pleas for help muffled from the outside. As Courage, attempts a daring rescue, the evil vet appears on the launch pad, determined to capture Courage and prevent any interference. With only 30 seconds left until the rocket's imminent launch, Courage desperately tries to outrun the pursuing evil vet. In a stroke of luck, he spots a garbage chute and dives into it, leading to a back alley adjacent to the launch pad. There, Courage watches helplessly as his parents are launched into space, a sense of profound sadness overcoming him as he tearfully waves goodbye. Fast forwarding to the present day, with just 40 seconds remaining until launch, the evil veterinarian hurls Muriel and Eustace, already captured, into the rocket. Sealing the rocket store, the vet ensures that his captives will be sent into space, eliminating any interference with his evil plan. However, just before the door is sealed, Courage manages a daring escape. Chased round the launch pad by the persistent vet, Courage fights back in a desperate attempt to free Eustace and Muriel, like with his parents earlier. As they watch the unfolding chaos through the rocket store window, Courage knocks over a bucket of hardware, causing the evil vet to slip and fall to the ground, seizing the opportunity, Courage rushes to the rocket store, attempting to open it and rescue his owners. Courage then struggles against the locked door, but despite his efforts, it remains unyielding. With just 30 seconds remaining before the rocket's imminent launch, Courage finds himself struggling to open the door to the rocket. In the midst of this critical moment, the evil vet, determined, to capture courage and trap him in the rocket once more, confronts the frightened dog, as the vet relishes in his sinister intentions, confident that he will succeed in carrying out his malevolent plan. As courage grapples with the stubborn door, the evil vet seizes the opportunity to grab him, attempting to secure him, alongside his owners, for the impending launch. However, in a moment of desperation, Courage's sharp instincts kick in as he spots a stethoscope on his lab coat. Recognizing it as an opportunity to turn the tables, Courage seizes the chance to confront the evil vet. With unwavering determination, he prepares to do what he does best, face his fears head on. Courage unleashes a piercing scream into the stethoscope. The sound reverberates through it, stunning the evil vet and catching him off guard. 
the tables turn as the vet, now in pain, screaming, and disoriented, finds himself momentarily neutralized by Courage's courageous and unexpected counterattack. With Courage disrupting the villain's plans and buying precious time, Courage seizes the moment to act decisively. Spotting a rocket door key, he moves swiftly, snatching it from the vet's pocket. In a testament to Courage's resourcefulness, he skillfully unlocks the rocket's door, freeing Eustace and Muriel from the imminent danger of being sent into space. In a quick and calculated move, Courage throws his owners into a nearby storage bin, preventing the evil vet from trapping them in the rocket again. As the vet takes off his stethoscope, trying to regain control of the situation, he ducks to avoid Eustace and Muriel being thrown into the bin. With just eight seconds remaining before the launch, the evil vet regains his composure and attempts to capture Courage once more. However, Courage, resilient and determined, turns the tables on the villain. Using the heavy door of the rocket to his advantage, Courage delivers a powerful blow to the vet's head. As the vet reels from the unexpected attack, he weakly laughs. In a final act of defiance, Courage shoves the evil vet into his own rocket, shutting the rocket store in the process. Following his successful maneuver, Courage swiftly retreats to reunite with his owners. As the countdown races towards its conclusion and the rocket's imminent launch, Courage seeks solace in Muriel's comforting presence. With the countdown reaching its climax, the computer announces launch as the rocket engines ignite beneath and the rocket launches, propelling the evil vet into space. Muriel, Eustace, and Courage witness the rocket lifting off, marking the defeat of the malevolent veterinarian and the end of his cruelty and twisted experiments. The trio stands in awe and relief as the rocket ascends, carrying away the source of their recent torment. Grateful for Courage's bravery and quick thinking, Muriel expresses her thanks acknowledging his role in saving them from an undesired space journey. Eustace, still disgruntled, asserts his refusal for courage to sit at the table, maintaining his cantankerous demeanor. In a poignant flashback, the episode revisits a crucial moment in Courage's past. As a vulnerable and frightened puppy, Courage had been abandoned in a back alley adjacent to the launch pad. Alone and helpless, he faced an uncertain fate. However, Fate takes a compassionate turn when Muriel discovers the abandoned pup. In an act of kindness, she scoops up the frightened puppy, calling him Courage. Recognizing the inherent courage within the small canine, Muriel decides to take him home, offering him a second chance at a loving and caring family. In the final scenes, Courage and Muriel sit on the porch, grateful for each other's company with Eustace still cantankerous and eating his food and Muriel wondering on what became of the cruel vet. The evil vet crash lands on an unknown planet, discovering that his breeding experiment has failed. Angry dogs, including Courage's parents, surround their veterinarian. The episode concludes when nervously, he laughs on screen before being mauled off screen, ending his reign of cruelty. Ending the episode. And that's how the episode goes. Thank God I never watched it and I never will. Or else it could have waste of my time. And my apologies will have to go John Adilworth who had directed this episode. I don't know who likes or hates this episode. And so, I am going to leave it be. Anyways. Fuck Remembrance of Courage Past. And fuck Little Muriel. Note. If you like this episode. You know the drill. Anyways. Pizza delivery. An episode from SpongeBob SquarePants. Is 45 million times better than Remembrance of Courage Past. End of rant.